Welcome to uh, the DVD Fiends, uh, week 15, this is Tuesday's edition. So it's kind of late at night right now, and I'm just going to go through, get, uh, get this video going pretty quickly. Um, I was going to do a review of a movie I just got today in the mail, because I got it for a pretty good uh, price off of uh, Half.com. And, uh, well, not able to do it, because it's, it's just so unbearably bad qual quality. I just couldn't get through it because of the sound and everything sucked on it. Uh, it's Frightmare with uh, Jeffrey Combs plays in this. That's the main reason why I bought it. It's a trauma release. Which I have to say, trauma really needs to get their shit together because about every release that they do is a piece of shit in quality wise. Um, especially if it's not one of their films. Um, even like the Toxic Avenger ones and like the Nukem High ones are kind of iffy iffy about a. Uh, quality. But this one is really bad. Let's just say that. Very, very bad. But, uh, anyways, yeah. Don't even waste your time with that. Wait until, like, snaps or someone else picks it up. That's what I would do. But the one I'm going to review today is one I don't really hear a lot about. It's, uh, based on a Stephen King book. A little story. And that is Thinner. Uh, basically it's about this guy. I can't remember if he's a lawyer politician or something like that. I haven't watched in a while. He, uh, he ends up running over, like, this, uh, really old, uh, a gypsy woman, and ends up killing her. Well, he gets a curse put on him to become thinner, and everybody who's involved with a group, he gets, he gets off on, like, this. He doesn't get in trouble for it or anything like that. And, uh, he starts getting thinner and thinner, and then other people, just, things start happening to them, and pretty much they're all dying too, you know, not necessarily all in the same way. And he's just trying to find out any way he can to save his own life. Well, if you haven't seen this movie, I don't want to give out the ending, but if you have, you know what happens in the end. Very cool ending. And it's kind of an ending I like. Um, it's not your it's an atypical ending for a horror movie. Because actually a lot of horror movies are yay, happy-go-lucky, you know, type of thing. But yeah, uh, this is the uh, Artisan release of it. Public Pictures. Um, pretty basic. Black and white disc. Um, pretty good quality. Uh, it actually has like some special features, surprisingly. It's in widescreen. It says pretty much makeup, uh, makeup effects feature. Auto commentary. And Oh, audio commentary, sorry. And that's about it on there. But yeah, uh, definitely pick this one up. Or check it out if you get a chance to. It's not as obscure a film as I wanted to do for this one. But uh, I do need some people to, if anyone wants to join. Because we still need Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. But I'll, I'll be doing, trying to do at least Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday if I can. Each one of those days, at least Monday, I know. But yeah, stay away from this. Uh, Pretty decent movie, it seemed like, but just bad quality. Uh, that's about it. Alright, guys, rate, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to come back for tomorrow for uh, Cafe Java Films' review. Alright, guys.